going the wrong way on I-55 when she slammed full speed into a 16 WAPT producer early this morning. Yeah, that crash could have been deadly. As 16 WAPT's Tammy Essig reports, the wrong way driver told police she can't explain how she ended up on the wrong side of the interstate. This is what's left after a woman driving on the wrong side of Interstate 55 slammed into a Ford Mustang. I hear this all the time about stuff moving in slow motion. I think I yelled Jesus and then just impact and that's it. Troopers say that accident happened around 10:30 Sunday night near mile marker 40. Now, according to the National Transportation Safety Board, they say that most of these wrong way wrecks happen between 6 p.m. and 6 a.m. the next morning. The driver of this mangled mess, Richard Bourne, happens to be a 16 WAPT news producer. How can you? Get into oncoming traffic, see cars are coming towards you, and not stop and turn around. Born escaped the crash with just a few bruises, but MHP says an ambulance had to take three people in that van to the hospital. The Highway Patrol says they see wrong way accidents on the Mississippi interstate all the time. How many times a year does Mississippi Highway Patrol get reports of wrong way drivers? Well, we get over approximately 100 a year throughout the state. This is video of a wrong way wreck from Collins, Mississippi in 2012. The crash left several people injured when police say the driver drove down the wrong side of Highway 49 and crashed into another vehicle. No. Oh my gosh. What is that driver supposed to do when they realize they're on the wrong side of the interstate. Well, we suggest you move over to the shoulder of the road immediately. Get out the oncoming traffic. Uh, if you need help, stay there. Call 911, and we can come out and assist you in getting turned around. Bourne says, from the looks of his car, he knew the accident could have been a lot worse. And all this time, have you had any problems? No, 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 no. Slow drivers or too fast drivers, never wrong way drivers. In Brookhaven, Tammy Eswick, 16 WAPT News. Now, we are working on getting the conditions of the people in that van. Investigators say the crash is still under investigation.